This is Pretty, and she works at the Symbolic Cafe. Her job is to make food for all the other Symbolics to eat. Show me what you've got. When Pretty gives the Symbolics their food, they give her symbolics in return. They're basically these little letters that I use to create things. This is actually quite fun. I'm glad she had a happy ending. What's that noise? This place sucks! How's this supposed to fill me up? That documentary of yours isn't a smart idea anymore, isn't it? No. Huh? Hey, Spine, what's up? You were right, Tace. This whole documentary was a mistake. It just doesn't feel the same without Yellow Aquarium, and I cannot get the Symbolics to cooperate at all. I told you we should have gone with my idea. Why bother trying to record the Symbolics doing random things when they don't want to, when we can just have people visit their town every day and have them understand us humans more? If you saw how I trekked the Time Lords back in our old dimension, You'll understand where I'm coming from. <sighs> Can't say I blame you for that. Look, Declan and Ellie don't want the show to continue. The Symbolics don't want the show to continue. Even I don't want the show to continue. Not even our own kids want the show to continue. It's been a really horrible time for us all. Maybe you're right. Maybe this documentary is a stupid idea. I made Ark as an archaeology robot to help Yellow Aquarium discover the folklore of the Greek Symbolics. As for the Symbolics of modern day, they had so much potential to be children's stars. Your wife and her friend should have never insisted on having Ark as the narrator instead of having me make a new robot for that job. Because three years of Ark believing the Symbolics through those Greek depictions would spell disaster. All the torture, shattered feelings and psychological trauma and abuse that Ark inflicted live on TV to make the Symbolics act like the Greek ones through 13 episodes and the company somehow didn't notice until the tail end where the situation escalated until the Symbolics hometown got destroyed by their own creators, thanks to Ark. It is because of the cut corners caused by the Yellow Aquarium Company that led to it filing for bankruptcy and all its assets being sold to us. If we let people visit Alphaville every day, the Symbolics will understand that not all humans just stand there, pointing a camera at them and talking over their daily lives. They're not objects, Spine. They're people just like us. Even if they are human beings, they are still the closest things to one. They may be larger than us, they may have massive heads and sphere eyes, and they may have big feet that look like sneakers, but they can still be nice and friendly if we just act that way to them, instead of just reminding them of their terrible past. We can make the Symbolics happy if we do what's right to them. If we want our living children's characters to be happy, we got to treat them with the respect they deserve. <laughs>